Hey everyone, what's the crack? My name is Effort Effects, and today we're going to be covering pen names. A pen name is an assumed name used by a writer instead of their real name. But why would you do such a thing? Well, there's a couple of reasons. Privacy. The first and most obvious reason most people choose a pen name is to stay under the radar, but this can go beyond a simple stride towards anonymity. You might use a pen name for work reasons. For example, if you're trying to write something with a lot of violence in it and you're a kindergarten teacher, you don't really want the parents to find out that you're a psycho. A pen name could also be used to hide if you don't want your family to know you're writing hardcore erotica. Same name. If your name is Stephen King, you might have a big problem on your hands. If your name is Will Smith, you might have a bigger problem. To distinguish yourself, you may consider changing your name to something original so people don't confuse you with an already well-known individual in the writing world or outside. Name Stereotyping Unfortunately, in the world we're in, you will be judged on your name. If you're a male writing a romance, some women will simply not give your book a second look, assuming a guy doesn't know anything about romance. If you're a female writing a book on war, some men will assume a girl just hasn't got what it takes. It's crap a lot of readers do this, but it may prove a smart move to change your name to something that follows your genre. If you're aiming to go professional as a writer, you may have to make this sacrifice. Cross genres. Some authors have several pen names for when they're writing in different genres. This allows readers to follow each genre and not get confused. This means when your reader just finishes your fantasy book and look you up, they won't see the rest of your normal erotica writing. Only the rest of your fantasy works written with that pen name. Revitalizing a career. Maybe you've got a bad name for yourself, maybe you've done a few bad things, maybe you're trying to move professional and you've wrote a lot of crap books in your time in your amateur years. If you're under a new name, a publishing company and the general public at large will not notice this new name or correlate anything with it and it can be a useful way to side skirt a few quite costly mistakes. Marketing. Not all names roll off the tongue. Seamus McSweeney Fly is a hard name to sell and doesn't roll off the tongue and is not really that memorable. Choosing a catchy name that both is easy to remember and pops out of a book can help in marketing. And that's it for the video guys, it's short and sweet. Like the video if you liked it, it always really really helps out the channel and if you got this far go into the comments and make yourself a new pen name. I am willing to accept both joke and real ones. As always I can't wait to see them, have a good day, best of luck in the book and I'll catch you guys next time. Thank <laughs> you.